So to manage the dual SIM cards in your Galaxy Z Fold 7, simply swipe up and then go to settings. And on settings, go to connections. And then under connections, go to SIM manager. So this is where you'll find your dual SIM cards setup. So you could have two physical SIM cards for your dual SIM setup, or you could have one physical and one eSIM because this Z Fold 7 has eSIM support, or you could have two eSIM cards. It doesn't matter as long as you have a dual SIM setup. So only two SIM cards are active at the same time. And then here you can choose your preferred default SIM card for doing different things. So for instance, we have calls, so you can choose which is a default SIM card for outgoing calls, either SIM 1 or SIM 2, or you can set your phone to ask always so that every time you try to make a call, it's going to ask you to choose at that particular time which SIM card you want to use for that particular call. And then the next call is going to ask again the next one, just like that. Or you can choose a default. Same goes for messages. You can choose the default SIM card for outgoing messages. And then you can also choose for mobile data. And also, once you choose a SIM card for mobile data, you can choose to enable data switching. So basically what this does is in case you've selected SIM 2 for mobile data and then you go into an area where SIM 2 doesn't work properly or it's not having good connectivity, you allow your phone to automatically switch the SIM card for mobile data to keep your connectivity consistent. Okay, so if you want that, you enable that. So that's basically how to manage the dual SIM setup. Now, if you go into more SIM settings, you can have options like dual SIM always on so that when one SIM card is unavailable, calls are automatically redirected to the other SIM card. So you can set that up from there. And then also you have now your, your dual SIM card security. So this is basically normal SIM security. So that's SIM pin, okay? So you can choose to enable SIM pin for SIM 1 and for SIM 2 independently. So this is SIM 1, you can do your stuff there in SIM 2. And then also you have the option to lock eSIM settings. So basically you lock eSIM settings with your phone password so that anybody without authorized access to your phone cannot add eSIMs, cannot remove eSIMs and stuff like that. So that's basically how to manage the dual SIM Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 7. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you have any comments or questions, you can talk to us down in the comment section. Good luck.